everybody, so I'm back, and this time I'm gonna give you something else you guys have all been asking me for, which is an everyday makeup look that I do. And I have to say, because I'm so fortunate to work with a lot of makeup artists that are really amazing, and I on world dance and different shows and events, that I don't actually do my own makeup that often. I used to do it all the time, but now I've sort of come down to this really minimal everyday makeup look but I wanted to show it to you and see what you guys think. I start off, I do a really good skincare routine, which I showed you guys before, but I like to really prep the skin, great, tons of sunscreen on. And then the first thing I always start with is this clay de I've talked about this before. This is so indicative of my life, by the way. I don't know where the top is to this concealer. But here we go. It's Clay de Peau, uh concealer in ochre. This is what I use legitimately every single day. And I just put a little bit like this and I put it all around this area. And I think for some reason for me, using my fingers for concealer, makes it a little more natural, pushes it in. And this stuff is magic. This concealer covers everything and it's very creamy. So I do it all kind of in this triangle area, this and around the mouth. And this concealer is a really good color for olive tone skins like mine. I have blue nails right now because I'm filming World of Dance and I'm wearing a blue dress, so I'm sorry if that's Uber distracting. Okay, so that's the first round. Sometimes that's all I do. Sometimes that's all I do for foundation. But on days that I want a little bit more, I use this foundation, which I actually don't even know how to say. Um, Suku? Suku? From Japan. But this foundation, because I have olive tone skin, has amazing yellow toned foundations for olive skin. So I do this, and then I just dab a little bit on the brush and I just around the outside of my face a little bit of coverage like this where the concealer didn't go and it kind of ties it all in kind of push it in sometimes I pat it in and this foundation is amazing because it's actually really light but it covers a lot and then I go around over where the concealer is and I do it on my eyes too God, guys I'm even giving you all my mirror faces this is gonna be very embarrassing to watch this back and then I even kind of take it down into my neck this even it out okay the foundation then I do my lids now this Jillian Dempsey has a lid tint in bronze she has a lot of different colors but I use the one in bronze and this for every day I'm obsessed with you just put a little on your finger and then you just dab it on the eye and it gives you a little dewy smoky eye kind of look it has a little mirror I sometimes look at when I want to get a little closer and it gives you I don't know if you can see it a very it looks really young and fresh. Like a little natural glossy smoky eye. Very easy. And then I use the Shumera eyelash curler every day. Sometimes I don't even wear mascara and I still use this every day. Then I do Charlotte Tilbury full fat lashes. You see this? This is what I'm using right now. So I put the mascara on. This is one I can't not do a mirror face, which I know you guys know about. I also do this when I look at myself in the mirror anywhere and I get made fun of it all the time. Okay, so I put the mascara on. I love bottom mascara. I put it on the bottom too. I know some people don't like that, but I love it. And once again, this is like a super natural running around town everyday look. Then I use my favorite, so I kind of do my eye makeup first, and then I use my favorite concealers. It by By Under Eye and Urban Decay Naked Skin, two incredible eyeliner or under eyes that I love. So I go like this. And I kind of do under eye, but I also do this little triangle area like this. And I dab it in. Again, I kind of use my fingers a lot. I don't know if it gets a bit much. I use, go back to this brush. And I dab it in. And then I use this Urban Decay Naked Skin a little bit like this. I learned of this from a makeup artist on set, and it is magical because it, it immediately takes away dark circles and it brightens the area. And you can kind of blend it all in together. Use it all around. And then I'm concealed, eyes are on. Next, I go for blush. So I'm not just saying this because she's my friend. Chrissy Teigen created the best blush highlighting compact with Becca, and I use it every day. See proof, look, it's like falling apart. So I first start with the highlighters. I mix the two of them together. It's this really nice brush from La Mer. And I put a little bit on this area. Right here, because that. And then I you love this blush, so I use a tiny bit like this. That just really brightens up the face immediately. And then sometimes, like today, if I'm feeling a little crazy, is the bronzer. And I go around the outside, jawline, 
pop in the nose, and then I just kind of I bring that down into my neck. Then comes my favorite part. I'm a stickler about brows, but I do them last. I brush them up, and I take Anastasia in Burnett. It's a perfect brow pencil. My trick is I only fill in a little bit at the top to round out the brow. Just on the top of it, and then I push it up, and I feel a little, it's kind of a little above my brow, but I like to kind of round the face and the brow a bit. And I don't like an overdone brow, so I know some people like to go in the bottom and do all that. I just do the top, it's what works on my face. Hold that, and it kind of thickens them, finishes the face. Because I love a glow, but sometimes it's a little bit much, I use this Hourglass Dim Light Ambient Lighting Palette. You can see this. And I use them all three like this. And I just put them a little bit like over my T-zone. This stuff is magical. I'm not being paid to say any of this, guys, by the way. This is just because I love these products. But this stuff is magical because it's a powder, but it gives you a candlelight airbrush look without looking powdery. I make them use this on set for me all the time. And then for lips, I really am loving this RMS Beauty. God, everything of mine is a mess because it goes through four different bags and purses and just mom life. You guys know what I'm talking about. This is lip to cheek. It's called Promise, but I use this on my lips and my cheeks. It's this kind of, a, it's like a peachy kind of pinky color. A little bit like this, and then go top, nook. Water. Whenever I lift over, I kind of dab right here, right here. Take my eyebrow brush I love, and I just kind of blend it all one last little time. And that is my 10-minute makeup everyday look. Can I see? Do we like? Do we approve? That's it. That's, that is if I even have time for this, <laughs> guys. Most of the time, it's three or four of those things in the car at stoplights. But if I have 10 minutes to do my everyday makeup, this is the look I go for. And I hope you guys liked it and let me know what you think and if there's any other ways you do your 10 minute makeup, I'd love to learn any other tricks you have, but that's, that's it for me. Bye.